having an unlock bootloader help us in many ways so today in this video i'll be showing you how you guys can unlock bootloader of any motorola device this is aryan thakur and you're watching waratech so let's get started i can keep a business Before doing anything just make sure that you back up all of your data on your device because it will be erased. Now let's power off our device cause we will be booting into the bootloader mode. Now once the device is powered off press the power button and the volume down button simultaneously. Keep holding it until you see your bootloader screen which look like this. Now once you see the screen now it's time that we connect our device with our PC. Now let's head over to the PC. Now once you are in PC, just make sure you have downloaded the Motorola device drivers and the minimal ADB fast boot. Now head over to this site. The link will be given in the description just below that like button. Just read everything carefully and click next. I repeat, only after reading click next. Now once you click next, you will be asked to sign in to the Motorola page. If you have a Motorola account, just use that or else use Google account. Now the second step is to get our device ID and unlock code. So open the minimal ADB and fastboot and type fastboot devices. Now once you type you will get your device detected. If your device doesn't get detected make sure you download the drivers carefully. Now we need to type fastboot oem get underscore unlock underscore data once you have typed the command hit enter and you will get a long string now here is the most important part these lines which you see are the bootloader data now we need to copy all of this data and paste it in a note editor you can use any note editor which you desire so i will be using the notepad now in notepad we need to paste the bootloader data and now you can see the bootloader tags in bracket so just delete all the bootloader tags and once everything is deleted you will see a long string of data which we need to copy to the motorola's website Now once everything is prepared, now we need to copy this string and we need to paste it to the uh, Motorola's website. So right here we need to paste our data and just click can my device be unlocked. Once it's done we need to scroll down and we need to agree to the terms and we need to request an unlock key. We will get a pop up that your warranty will be void just ignore it and click ok now it's the last and the final step which is to unlock our bootloader so head over to your account which you have given to the motorola and you will see a email so right here you can see i have my unlock code now we need to copy this unlock code and type some commands Now copy this unique code and open your command window of the fastboot mode and type fastboot oem unlock with your code. Now once you have typed your command just hit enter and you will see a warning. This command will erase all your user data. That is the reason why I was telling you need to back up. Now we need to retype this command. So again type fast boot oem unlock and followed by the unique key and hit enter. And once it's done, it will show bootloader is unlocked rebooting phone. Now for some odd reasons your phone may not reboot. No need to worry, it's normal. 
Now for some odd reasons if your device didn't boot just don't worry click on start and you will see this typical Motorola bootloader warning. So just don't worry if you see this warning your device will reboot extremely fine and you will be back to normal. No need to worry. Now once you have unlocked your bootloader just go ahead and try to root your phone. So the routing guide will be in the description which I just made and hope you will like it. Now once your device will reboot you need to set up the whole device. So thank you guys for watching hope you like this video. Like, subscribe, comment and share this video.